Following a brief hiatus, we're back with another edition of Reaching One Classroom at a Time, where Fat Dogs and the Wilkinson Company reward teachers for finding innovative ways to impact their classroom. Let's send it to KNLP's Kelsey Wilkinson, who has more. We have reached another episode of Reaching One Classroom at a Time, and folks, we have reached week 16, so that means we have four more episodes remaining, and we find ourselves here at North Platte High for the journalism teacher and Miss Megan Kelly. Now, Miss Megan Kelly has two things on the agenda. First and foremost, she wants to send 10 of her students out to a convention out in San Francisco to help journalism and to help these kids network and potentially find some type of connect outside of Nebraska. And then the last thing that she wants to accomplish here too is to get some new cameras so that the yearbook looks spectacular. So with that being said, we are here to go ahead and make that dream come true. And we're gonna go ahead and see how she feels. Mrs. Kelly. Okay. Oh. Mrs. Kelly. Yeah. My name is Kelsley Wilkinson. I'm with KNOP and on behalf of Fat Dogs and the Wilkinson's company, we want to congratulate you for being this week's recipient of reaching one classroom at a time oh, so the students can go ahead and leave their heart and find their voice in San Francisco and so you guys can get some new cameras so the yearbook looks fantastic. How do you feel? Uh, I'm pretty excited. How much money do we have? Oh my God, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> She's about to get three thousand mother loving dollars. You kidding me? Congratulations! Get out, There's a whole um, one of the nights they get to do a student swap shop and take their publications and just meet with kids and other publications from all across the country and share ideas, networking, like you said. It's a phenomenal opportunity for the kids. And part of the thing I put in the grant was. A lot of these kids haven't been maybe outside of Nebraska, but definitely not as far as San Francisco. I inherited a handful of these cameras from the previous teacher. Um, they're definitely high quality, but they're, they're getting well into their years and need some redos. So giving them the quality materials to be able to um, succeed in whatever, the photos they're making, the making these publications, which is another thing that's pretty phenomenal. These kids can say they've been published. Thank you, Fat Dogs and the Foundation.